2K Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, is delighted to present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Valero Texas Open is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this second round action. I'm Luke Elvey, here alongside Rich Beam. And Rich, this next golfer starts their round. What do you think about their chances? Second place currently, so everything is going quite well for this golfer, but there's a lot of golf yet to be played. Can they catch a leader? Let's find out. Well, I'm looking forward to today, that's for sure. Let's see what kind of Tony sets for himself today. Pretty good shot there. And what are we looking at here, Henny? Yeah, he's got roughly 110 to the pin here. That might be one club too many. well struck what are we looking at for this part Henny firm back up the hill this will be a good one looking really good this one that one not quite reaching to the hole there well I think they fell in love with the line forgot about the pace the leaderboard has them sitting in second, one spot back of Xander Shoffley. Welcome to this par five hole. Straight away for the most part, but there's a lot of danger both right and left here. The fairway bunkers down the left-hand side shouldn't really cause an issue. However, the second shots, the layup zone, there is a deep bunker on the right-hand side that could be brought into play. The third shot is to a green perched well above the fairway, and it's actually a double green. This green is also part of the seventh green. Second shot on the second. Getting ready to play their third. Oh, you beauty, an eagle. Oh, beautiful little pitch shot down the hill. Thank you. Gets it to go. Great shot. Quick look at the leaderboard has this player currently in first place with Xander Shoffley in second. Gotta like it, moving up the leaderboard, never a bad thing. Here they are, full of confidence on the next tee coming off the eagle. You really hope that the wind is not blowing into your face on this tee shot and making it that much more difficult and longer. This green is perched up high. There's runoffs all around the left-hand side and the back portion of it, and obviously you want no part of coming up short. Players that find this green will find it difficult to two-putt as there's lots of humps and bumps and swales in it. Nice line. Look at him just surging ahead at the top of the leaderboard. Just the start they were looking for, Luke. And now that finds him in first place. Time to face a par four.
Oh, that's a high caliber shot. Second shot here on the fourth. Game of the seven. Oh, come on, sit. Yeah, not a bad effort, that one. Up onto the green and a chance to hold your putt. Trying to get to 16 under with this putt. This for back-to-back -back birdies. Just didn't drop. He's got a par putt here. Let's see if he can make it. Now leading by one shot. This is a short par four, always a fun hole to play. Really hoping they play this one aggressively. Good shot there, Beamer. Second shot here on the fifth. Oh, I thought that one was going in. Oh, that was tidy. That should ensure the up and down. Oh, Dr. Chapinski strikes again. He finds himself in a share of the lead. Oh, well struck. This drive's heading for the fairway in my eyes. From about 100 yards. He's currently tied for the lead. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. This one looks to be on a pretty good line. That's inside the house of opportunity. Let's catch up with a human one iron. Will Zalatoris from earlier. Holding this one out. Gotta say, I did not see that shot coming. Well done. He yeah, has about 14 feet to the hole. Looking for another birdie here. Yeah, you like the look of that right off the blade. Back to back birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. And staying right where they were in today's rankings after that. Deep into the front nine, here we are at the seventh hole. Okay, that'll work. And this putt is for a big two on the scorecard. This one looking really good. That one had eyes for it the whole way.
And now we have this player currently sharing top spot on the leaderboard with the legendary Tiger Woods. Pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. Well, I like the look of the line here. This should find the fairway. Second shot here on the eighth. Where will this one end up? And here we are with the third shot. He's currently tied for the lead. And they've done it. Hold another shot from way out. Can't believe this, Luke. Again today, simply absurd. What did this guy do this morning? Oh, that's an absolute beauty, hey, Beamer. Why don't we take another look at it? Yeah, they were looking at an up and down, but just down. Stop if you've heard this before. Tiger is coming off a birdie on his last hole, and that will take him to one off the lead. And the gap is closing on our leader, Luke. Teeing off now on the ninth hole. Not a single bunker on this hole. Tee shot is fairly straightforward. Just hit it straight, find the center of the fairway. The second shot, however, gets a little interesting as this green is very deep, not very wide. Big runoff areas on both sides of this green. A par here is a solid number. And Henny, what's he looking at here? Setting up here from about 165 yards. Looks to have opted for the eight iron. This looks to be hit pretty well from where I'm standing. Pay attention, folks. That's how you play golf. And a fantastic look upcoming. Four feet to the cup. And racking up their fifth birdie of the day. So as we head into the back nine, Rich, what are your thoughts on this player? Yeah, but I, I like the position. I like being out in front. It forces the other players to come catch you. I like their position. Now on the tee after a birdie, fired up and ready for more. Generous driving area on this downhill par four that dog legs slightly from left to right. Second shot will be back up the hill to a green that's well protected by three bunkers. This is a good birdie opportunity if you find the fairway. That tee shot looks pretty good. Why don't we catch up with our man in the hot seat, Tiger Woods? Good look here for a second shot. And into the hole it goes. And back to the play, shall we? And he's down there. Yeah, he's got a round 125 here. And choosing the eight iron here. Well, this one's right at the pin.
Gee, it's metronomic here. Green after green. Gee, golf looks easy when you're playing like this. Well, the practice is paying off here, Luke. This player is relentless. They're lining up the birdie putt here. It's got a chance. Well, nicely done. Holds the putt for back-to-back -back birdies. That's a momentum maker, isn't it? Back-to-back -back birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. He's currently in a share of top spot. Always positive coming off a birdie. Let's see what happens here. Tee shots must be placed on the left-hand side to get the best view and angle for their second shots as the screen sits below the player and moves from left to right. Tee shots down the right might be closer, but it's going to leave a second shot over a deep bunker and making it that much more difficult to get close. Oh, that was pure. Henny. What's the player facing here? I can see the 125 yard marker just nearby. Going with the eight iron here. That's a tad wayward. Not quite finding the surface. What's well, a strange miss there. Look, they've been hitting the greens all day long. Nine feet to the cup. This for par. Ooh, right by the hole. And this one will be for bogey. And as we move along, it's Tiger on top of the leaderboard. Let's see what happens here at the 12th. Looks like this one's heading safely for the fairway. And let's catch this action from just a moment ago. Look at the touch that this man possesses. Let's return to live play now. Playing this shot from around 120 yards. Two strokes off the lead. That's a good shot by him. He'll be delighted. What's in front of them, Henny? Setting up this putt 22 feet from the cup. Looking really good. Well, what a way to bounce back. Nice putt to hold. Our leader is a couple of shots up at this stage. We have a par three on this one. Second shot here on the 13th. How close was that to going down?
If he makes this, he'll save his par. Good stuff today, especially the short game has been really sharp today. Big chance here. Oh, what a super shot. Trailing by a couple of strokes now. It's time to tee off here at the 14th hole. No harm, no foul there with that shot. They've had a chat with the caddy and they're going for it. This one's on. Seems to have chosen the three wood. This one might need to sit. Not able to find the green in two, but a bold play. Looking at the caddy, a bit too much club there. Ooh, that almost went down. This putt coming up is for birdie. The leader now has a one-stroke advantage. Let's see what happens here on the 15th. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? I'd say he's about 165 from this flag. Oh, stop it. What a shot. Gotta like their chances from there. This putt to move into a tie for first. It was on a good line. An opportunity to make their par. That's a disappointing par in the end after such a terrific shot in. Opportunity lost and one they needed to take advantage of sitting just two back of the lead. And a very familiar sight. Tiger Woods on top of the leaderboard. Teeing off here on the 16th hole. Only one other place I can think of, and that is the sixth at Riviera. A larger green than the sixth, but bunkers galore. Watch out for the one right in the middle. Looks to be going with the five iron. Trying to get it to move a little bit to the left here. Yes, any time you can find the green and have a putt, you'll take it. Would need to make a long putt to secure a birdie. Sitting up here with a very long putt. Oh, hit a house. And Henny, what are they looking at here? Just got to trickle this one in the front door. It's downhill. This one's tracking. That gets the job done. And after that hole, the standings have this player in second place behind Tiger Woods. And now we find ourselves with a par four here. <laughs> 
Second shot here on the 17th hole. Nicely done. Just 10 feet to the cup here. And that will drop in for birdie. Well, that's certainly a step in the right direction. Keep it going. Teeing off here at the lucky last, the 18. Well, there's no doubt they'd have some positive vibes coming off that birdie. Let's see if they can keep it rolling. Could not be more perfect. I'm pretty sure that's not how we saw that one playing out. Rich, always like going back and looking at T-Dub and some of the magnificent stuff he delivers. Our current leader is showing us why they're on top. Getting ready to play their third. Currently tied for the lead. I'm pretty sure that wasn't the shot he anticipated hitting. And here we are with their fourth. Oh, wouldn't that have been nice? Oh, wonderfully played chip shot. Great touch. Putting for par.